Okay, okay. Hi, what's up, you guys? Welcome back. <laughs> what? what do you want? Stop licking me! <laughs> Hi, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to MJ Views. Today, as you can already tell, Stella is super excited for this video. I decided that we go ahead and share with you guys Stella's toy box. Of course, she has her favorites, but for the most part, she'll play with everything in her toy box. And whenever I get her toy box out, she's just super excited. So this is her toy box. It's literally just a basket I got from Goodwill for like 10 bucks. I bought her a somewhat decent, it's kind of small, um, and I bought her this type, the size of toy box because um, I just thought it wouldn't fill up because Stella rips most of her toys. They're mostly made out of rubber. The ones that aren't are rockets or the ones I bought for like video purposes. I'm surprised she hasn't ripped this one yet. If you guys saw the Halloween video, she did rip the others too, and they're already in the trash. Yeah, but she hasn't ripped this one. I guess because she doesn't really play with it either, because it doesn't like squeak or anything. And she doesn't really like toys that don't squeak. This one is Rockets. And I don't let Stella touch it at all. You see how clean these toys are? Because they don't get in Stella's grasp. As well as his first toy ever, which is this bunny looking toy. So for the sake of the video, I'm gonna take them out. I don't know if she'll like end up wanting to get them or anything. So yeah, this is Stella's toys, generally. Uh, most of them make up of like rubber toys. She cannot destroy them and I always emphasize this in my videos. Um, this is a Chuck It, so I'm also going to take this out because I know she's gonna try to get it because she loves this toy. She loves fetch. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and put it down and see which ones she likes to show you guys, which one's her favorite, and let's see if she likes to <laughs> show you guys her favorite toys. That would be really cute, huh, Stella? Oh my god. What are you doing? Which one do you want? You want you want your tennis ball? Or is it too cool? Too down there you can't get it wow <laughs> nova you want to get a toy get a toy can i see it can i see your toy oh thank you of course this is Stella's favorite toy, the tennis ball. The only reason why I know it's her favorite is because she has not torn it up, which is a very, very hard thing to believe because she literally tears up every tennis ball ever. Can you get your other toy? Get your toy. Get your toy. One eternity later. Ooh, that's a nice one. You like that one? She wants her done as well. <laughs> All right, so I guess I'll just go over some general things that are in here. So she has a couple of these non-destructible bones. They're literally made out of like tough rubber. These I use for chewing, but whenever I leave them alone, they love to chew on them in replace of like anything else, basically. <laughs> Um, she really loves this toy that I got from Pets Porn. <laughs> it squeaks and everything. Along with this one that we got from the Puppy Box. Um, and I have a couple links to these if you guys are interested. She always, this is a good opportunity to say that she always tries to take out the squeaker of these toys. Like She'll squeak it until she actually gets the squeaker out. And then she'll destroy it. Like, she'll be like, okay, it's over with. What are you getting? No, nothing? Okay. So I do have some treat dispensing toys. Um, these, you put like little crackers inside and it's rubber as well. This one is bendable. It like rolls and like goes everywhere. And then you put treats inside as well. I also have this actual 
treat dispensing toy that you can also put food in. It's like a slow feeder kind of thing and it keeps them entertained. I also do have another ball, but this is Rockets because I know that she could destroy it. It's like a little flimsy as well with this one. Rocket loves balls, but he doesn't get to play with them because Stella destroys everything. And then we have our tug of war toys. This one is almost destroyed. Tug of war toys never last. Like, look at this. Yeah, she loves her tug of war toys because she could play with her friends. And um, I guess she doesn't love them that much because she destroys them. But this one's also a treat dispensing toy. You put treats in like these little crevices. And it's supposed to clean their teeth as well. And if you guys already know, I also have this alligator toy that I got from a vendor that cleans their teeth as well. Like spiky looking things are meant to clean their teeth. This one does squeak a lot and Stella loves this toy. And I think it's just really cute and it's made out of rubber. And I thought she would even like get the eyes to be like worn off, like worn away. But the eyes are actually still on, which is awesome because then it wouldn't look the same. It wouldn't look like the alligator that it is without the eyes. So I think that's amazing. I, I would think they'd be gone by now. She always like... She always has this toy. She loves this toy. <laughs> and then of course her ball. It's actually a Nerf Chuck It. So all the balls that come with the Chuck It toy, I don't like to give her because I don't want to risk not having a ball to throw with the Chuck It because not everything fits in the Chuck It toy. So I don't let her play with this unless we're actually playing with the toy outside. So then I also have her Frisbee. She loves her Frisbee and this is another thing that I don't let her play with of course if we're not playing Frisbee. It's a little worn out off but it's lasted quite some time. At least two years. Right Stella? And I love these because they have like bumpers, rubber bumpers that if it hits them in the face it's not going to hurt. So it's better than a plastic one, in my opinion. I need to get her a new one because it's like really old. And Nova and Stella took out this bone. These are Atler bones and they love them. <laughs> These are the bones I leave them so they don't destroy the house. They can chew on them forever. They last about like two months each of them because they're so sturdy. But they clean their teeth and they're really good for them. So it's a win-win-win situation. Right. So yeah, these are all Stella's toys. Um, she does have quite a few now that I'm looking at it. I just try to keep everything like good. If I notice she's like picking at this, I noticed this while I was doing an assignment and I was like, Stella, no. And I took it away from her, but it was too late because she had torn it and it just started unraveling, which is not good. But the good thing about this is that these balls will last even if the tug of war won't. And then I just wish they could like do tug of war better. She does have a super big tug of war toy that's like super big and I'll show it in a clip. That has lasted just because well, it's super big and she can't tear it. Of course, fluffy toys, I just don't get fluffy toys for Stella at all anymore because she'll tear them for sure. Or balls like this. These balls are like the worst for her. I would recommend like a rubber ball for that just so they don't bite through it and it'll last longer. Stuff like this as well. Hard rubber or just rubber in general are really good because they can't really chew through it. Um, or if they can, it'll take them a while to. But yeah, that's about it. I hope you guys enjoyed Stella showing you all about her wonderful toy box. I usually have it free roaming so she could just pick them out whenever she's bored. So I usually have it like in a corner of my room. It's really cool um, to have a toy box like this because when I get home, she literally goes upstairs to her toy box and brings down a toy as if like you're home we can play now kind of thing which is really cute. One last thing I want to announce of course before the video ends is the giveaway winners. So I picked the winners yesterday through Instagram but of course if you guys didn't see that that's why I'm going to announce them here as well. You guys are the winners of the toys. So excited. Stella, tell them how much you love your toy. Yeah. <laughs>
And these are the winners of the two alligator toys that we had previously mentioned in our other videos. Congratulations to you guys who won the giveaway. And thank you for all of you guys who entered the giveaway and participated. I do plan on doing more giveaways in the future, so hopefully you guys have a shot at winning at those. But I will be contacting you real soon to ship over the toy to you guys. And I hope you and your dogs enjoy the toy as much as me and Stella do. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for participating in the giveaway once again. If you guys want to see more of my content, go ahead and click on my channel. Click subscribe. It's completely free. And you'll see more videos like these with Stella and Nova and Rocket. But besides that, thank you guys so much for watching. I truly, truly appreciate you taking your time to watch my video. And I hope to catch you guys in the next one. Bye!